want to coach league one day? Oh, look, if, it, if there was an opportunity there, I'd, I'd jump at it. Would you like to perhaps coach South one day? Oh, look, that would be the dream team, mate. That would be the dream team, you know. From the age of five, I supported South, so uh, that would be fantastic. If an offer came to you, would you consider it? Oh, 100%, mate. The decimated Sea Eagles completing their captain's run without the stand-down seven, who are refusing to elaborate on why they won't wear Manly's Pride jersey. How difficult a decision was it, Josh? One person willing to talk about the boycott, the Sea Eagles' rival coach for tomorrow's match. And for us in 2022 to, to not be inclusive and not say it's OK to be who you are is, is unacceptable. Trent Robinson praising Manly's management for standing firm and promoting diversity. I think it's great what the owners of Manly have decided to do and it's unfortunate that it's panned out this way because everyone's equal. No matter what race, gender, sexual preference, then everyone's equal. The Roosters coach disappointed with the slow progress of acceptance in rugby league. If someone said they weren't going to wear the Indigenous jersey, there'd be an outcry. 40 years ago, that, that, that would have been the case. You know, 80 years ago, we wouldn't have had women in league round. We've moved on those fronts. We haven't moved on this. Robinson hopes his club will commission its own rainbow jersey, even if some of his players refuse to wear it. That's a decision for clubs and the game to make, but my personal opinion, um, I'm about equality and, and, and I want people to feel like they're cared for and loved and have a place no matter their sexual preference in the world. But a league-wide pride round still feels a long way off. I don't think they're the only team that'll have that drama. Obviously, um, yeah, high sort of religious sort of throughout all the teams, I guess. So if there was a problem there, I dare say it would have been a problem in other teams as well. Luke Doversy, Nine News.